Greetings everyone, we are here at the 5th Annual Entrepreneurship and Small Business Summit right here at Gwinnett Tech inside the George Busby Building. And we've caught up with Miss Pamela Alexander of BizLinks TV. How are you doing? I am doing wonderful. <laughs> Having a great time. That is great. Now, is this your first year attending this summit? Oh, no, no, no. Oh. no we, we have been with Austin quite a while. Um, mm -hmm. we, I think we missed one of the five. So it has been a fantastic experience. We enjoy supporting Austin every single year that he does this. It's just going to get bigger and better. Nice, nice. And so from the first one that you attended mm -hmm. to now, what has that experience been like? How, what areas have you seen growth or development in? You know, I think the, the level of the vendors has grown quite a bit, yes. definitely the speakers as well. But you know, it's always great content regardless. Okay. Um, so the, the speakers, they're just different each year, but I think the content as business is growing, we're learning more and more, talking about being global, talking about how to collaborate more, learn how to market our businesses. So I've seen that step up each and every single year. The level of attendees, the level of networking has grown every single year. So I'm just looking forward to it being bigger and better and bigger and better every single and the venues keep getting fantastic so this is a really great yes, venue. it is it is I mean it is the International Center <laughs> of Workforce Development yep. I'm looking at the sign it's right over there <laughs> <laughs> so tell us a little bit about your business BizLinks TV BizLinks TV BizLinks TV Network we are a um, platform really for businesses to be able to get their content out so we do that in several different ways we help businesses that have video podcasts and help them create and produce their video podcasts so they can really set themselves up as an expert in their industry mm -hmm. we work with those who are already doing their own video a lot of people are doing their own video because technology has really allowed them to do that mm -hmm. and uh, so but they need a platform they need to get out beyond their own their network so they work with us as well and then we have local shows so our show that's my biz where we help businesses get exposure I do interviews with small businesses so that more people know about them in the end it's all about getting more exposure exposure for your business and our shows are on our website they're on Roku they're on Apple podcast as well as Android podcatchers that is phenomenal. Wow. We love doing it. I love technology. For those out there that know me, they know I love technology. So we've really been able to take this medium and use it to help businesses grow. So they don't have to have all of the overhead and understand how to do it all in editing, but they have some fantastic product that they can put out there to their audience. Right. Oh, that's awesome. That's <laughs> awesome. So what led you to begin doing BizLinks? How old is BizLinks? Oh my goodness. Well, BizLinks Consulting Group started in 2001, so I won't take you all the way back to the history, but we did start out as a web design company. Okay. And then with that, I, my love has always been teaching and explain the technical to the technically challenged. So I then took the business and really started working with the businesses on the business of their website because most didn't understand that mm -hmm. and went back to my love which is the training and really training those who are technically challenged and helping them really understand how to use technology in their business. Mm -hmm. We went on from there for four years I served as Constant Contacts Regional Development Director and helped businesses learn about email marketing and social media marketing and started the BizLink Center which was a um, co-working space in Duluth. And with that, we had a lot of great networking, we had a lot of great businesses, and we had a studio there for businesses so that you could come and do your web calls instead of having the dogs and the babies in the background. Oh, yeah. You could use our <laughs> space for that. And we started doing shows there, and then once we closed the center, we went into a studio and truly focused on BizLinks TV Network and built it up as a network to help others get their shows out. And so here we are today. Wow, what a beautiful progression. <laughs> Thank you for that. I've never done the summary in that short of a time. Yeah, that was a quick trip down memory lane. Yes, absolutely. That absolutely. Awesome. It's all been a labor of love. Mm -hmm. Working with small businesses, that's what we love. So, mm -hmm. And that's why you're at the Small Business <laughs> Summit today. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> well, could you tell us where our viewers could check out what you have going on at BizLinks? Certainly, certainly. So, of course, you can find us on social media. We are BizLinks TV Network. And then our website is www.bizlinks.com. TV and of course on Roku please add our channel if you're on Roku you can sit back on your couch watch all of our fantastic shows that's BizLinks TV Network channel Apple Podcasts as well as Android Podcatchers you can catch us it's BizLinks TV I love it thanks for joining us here Certainly. on Caribbean Life TV as well see the nice collaboration on <laughs> BizLinks TV that's right. Caribbean Life TV that's what it's about collaboration <laughs> man thank you again Miss Pamela absolutely thank you so much for having me fantastic <laughs> guys stay tuned <laughs>